you gotta listen up, listen up. There's not a thing that I can get from you. Boy, I don't need that much, need that much. How can I tell you what I wanna do? I never needed you to give me things. I never needed gifts or diamond rings. All I ever need, I need, I. All I ever need is here with you. This place where we can go, where it's all shining like the snow. Listen to your heartbeat. Good morning guys I wanted to start off by showing you um, my outfit of the day this is one of those tops it's like a sweatshirt but it's got this like detail on the sleeves and it's kind of see-through from thread up and I have my I'll put the link down below in my description box but you get 30% off your first order and I loved them so definitely check them out these are jeans I got from um, Ross last year I bought a few of them but I love their jeans I think they fit really well and then those are my Walmart shoes. So I think we're going to leave here in a little bit. And let me take you in here. We have Tug is still here. He goes home tomorrow. But in my last vlog, I had mentioned he had a little accident when he first got here. He got sick because he got sad that his mommy wasn't here. And he threw up on my rug. And it was like lime green yellow and it was the way the rug was made you guys all gave me great ideas on how to get it out but it was the way the rug was made it would unravel when I scrubbed it so I think we're gonna head to Ross or maybe a few if that guy will let me um and try to find a rug to put back on here I mentioned in my last video too that I'd try to find one on Amazon, but guys, they're so expensive there. It's so hard to pay that price if I can find one at Ross. So we're gonna get out here in a few minutes and go search around. So this is better lighting in here. So I thought I'd show you this shirt. Look at that sleeve, it's not really cool. And it's actually like cold and rainy here. So I'm actually getting to wear like fall clothes. I'm not like sweating. It's not summer here right now. It's super, super cold. So that's why I threw on this outfit, but it makes me so ready for fall. So I told you guys we were about to leave, but I'm getting hungry and we know what that means. <laughs> Shake the set. So we're gonna eat, um, I'm gonna eat some leftovers, some with grilled cheese. We're gonna eat lunch and then we'll head out. Don't you know? Thank you so much. 
with that being said um, sponsorships is another way that I get paid and I've been working like 40 50 hour weeks just to get videos up it's a lot of work and now I'm back working as a homeschool mom so I have that into it and I feel bad because I haven't done sponsorships in a while like I feel like I've gone quite a few weeks without them but they're all about to hit like they're gonna end up kind of being back to back and I don't want you guys to get offended or feel bad just remember this is my job and as much as I love it I can't work that many hours and not get paid like that's time away from my husband that's time away from Savannah that's time I'm like you know looking on my phone answering comments or filming or editing or dropping Savannah somewhere off so I just want you guys to know that I do love you and I appreciate you and I'm never gonna take a sponsorship that I don't feel like is helpful for you guys or that I don't enjoy or that I don't like I'm very very picky with them and I just kind of fell into my lap that there was like what three and some of them yeah. are reoccurring that you guys see but then others are just ones that came up and I'm honored I'm honored that you guys have grown me to a point that these companies want to work with me so thank you guys so so much please do not get offended there'll be times where you see sponsorships and there'll be times where you don't but you're just about to hit a point where there's going to be a few really close together but I love you guys and thank you for all the love and support and I always like to put in the perspective of um, like I work 40 hours a week at my job and if I was not getting paid to do a service and provide a service um, I would not be going to work yeah. if I'm not gonna go work 40 hours a week and not get paid for it right. luckily we just love doing YouTube and Ashley loves the videos and loves editing but it also is um, a job now with as much time as she's spending 40 to 50 hours a week because I get two days off I work five days a week she works seven days a week has her phone with her constantly so she's always available for her job and doing that so uh, it's just one of those things I put in perspective would I work 40 to 50 hours a week even if I loved it for free right. no way income no money not able to pay bills with it not able to give with it uh, not able and, to I, and I might do it as a hobby and post one a week but definitely I would not be working this much away from Savannah my yeah. time away from her is very very precious so if I'm gonna spend time away from her or if she's gonna have to play in the room by herself anything like that I just feel like I do want to be yes. reimbursed for that yep. and you guys have probably noticed too if you don't follow me on Instagram that's kind of where I update people but I've also pushed back my video posting time to 8 30 I just I was posting at 6 45 so like from the moment I woke up I was working and like I literally check messages until I fall asleep yep. like no every, matter, every couple of minutes every day every couple minutes I'm making sure I'm staying up on comments so I went ahead and pushed that back because I felt like I needed time to read my devotional I needed time to pray I needed time to spend time with Savannah and have breakfast and then my workday starts and that has made a huge difference but all this just to say I really really love you guys and I love the support and yeah. I'd say 98% of you get that and are so so kind to me but there are some people that are getting mad when they see the sponsored video but that is just paying me for my game. time yeah, yeah it's the like, name of the game just to get compensation yeah. for the hard work you do on YouTube and we see all the other channels that are bigger than us well, and we and totally I, understand yeah. why they have to do sponsorship and I'm getting that because of your guys' love and support Definitely. like that is all because of you guys so we are so thankful um, we pray for you guys all the time like we know we're on this journey because of God and you and so thank you so much I'm gonna hold you tight hold you tight cause you're the only thing that I can't lose I never needed you to give me things I never needed gifts or diamond rings all I Okay, first Ross, done. They had some, but they were either too small or like not the right gray. So now we're gonna head on just a few like doors down. There is a Home Goods, so we're gonna go in there. A few of you had suggested them, but they have some good prices, so we're gonna run in there and see what we can find. You 
can buy your way into my heart But you don't see that I just want you You get me things, but I don't care Baby, there is a place where we can go Where it's always shining like the snow Listen to your heartbeat, don't you know See if there's any others that are similar for a little bit less first, but it was a good one. I like it. It's really it nice. It was soft. It was beautiful. It was big, which I think bigger the better because it could actually like go underneath my sectional. But it was 300, and my agent doesn't approve me spending those fun jets. <laughs> I just like seeing what else is around. So we're gonna head into Tulsa. Yeah. In Tulsa, we're gonna go to a few more Rosses and see if we can get lucky before we lay down. The big bucks. I was gonna say, on the <laughs> maybe the big city will have more options than the little city. You've been up underneath my skin. No one's ever gonna win, so we might as well get in now. Still, the fights always leave a thrill. I can imagine all I will. You go on, I know the drill now. I've been getting high from this drug for longer than I know. Now it's time to go. You know, a long time ago. I know what you're gonna say. I know what you'll do to me. I know I'm not gonna stay. <laughs> Try to get up. You're dragging me down. Better back up. I'll turn it around. So today was not the best day to go rock shopping. It was pouring, and we're not gonna go any more Rosses because they're all having like the same size and the same design but somebody had either messaged me or comment and said if I had an at home to check there because they have good rugs at decent prices um, and we're not too far from one so we're gonna go try there and then if not we'll have to decide if we want to try to find one online and order it or if we're gonna go back and get the one at home goods and also get anything to say I'm just focusing on the road with this <laughs> rain. Try to get up, 
the street her American Girl doll her kid cannot call them baby dolls um, had a birthday today so all the neighborhood kids um, we're out of school here I don't know why must just yeah, be a random a teacher, day some, type of, so teacher some day. type of teacher's day so they planned a birthday party so we dropped Savannah off and she's they even had cupcakes made and stuff for it so they're over there having fun what I didn't show is that we went back to TJ Maxx to look at the rug and walked out without it and then, do we want to run in there? No, probably not. Uh, yeah, we can. And then, got home. I just can't make up my mind. It's a lot of money. And so I don't want to have buyers for remorse. And I don't know, we just can't make up our mind. I think we're gonna go back for a third time. It stopped raining, I think a while ago, like when we were there the second time it was pouring, so we didn't want to even get it because I don't know how we would have put it in our car. We are gonna run into one little, it's not like a boutique, what would you call it? Uh, I mean, it's, it's a cute little store and they sell like Magnolia Market stuff and rugs. They're probably decor. super expensive, but we thought maybe there could be a clearance item we could get lucky. And so we're gonna check one more spot before we decide on the last one. And I did not mean for this whole vlog to be about rug shopping. I thought we'd walk into Ross, find it and walk out because that's typically how it works for me. Like yeah. I'm like, oh, I need a rug, rug. I walk into Ross, I buy it, I walk out. It's probably we probably spent 20 minutes shopping like vlog wise. Yeah, probably so. so. Sorry, I'll try to speed it up for you guys. We don't have to search this long. No, like normally it's just like boom there and I may even have a few options so. And we looked online but it's just tough because you don't get to feel it, don't get to see the exact color. I feel like if I'm gonna pay close to what I'm gonna pay at Home Goods, I'd rather just spend $50 more and know exactly what it looks like, what it feels like. Like I want it to be soft. If I'm gonna buy a shag rug, I don't, and the reviews don't seem that great. I don't know, yeah. it's been a rough day. But are we gonna go get it or are we not? Yeah, we need, we need to go check it out. If we get, it, get it, yeah. maybe we can actually do something in this vlog other than you guys seeing me talk in the car <laughs> and we'll move the sofa. I need a vacuum underneath it anyways. Yeah, who and knows what's under there? I've seen a couple of things under there. Snowballs. Some <laughs> yeah, snowballs. like the fake ones. Um, some toys. So yeah, we'll clean that out, put the rug down, put everything back together and see how it looks. And then you guys can vote if you like it or not. Sounds good. Okay. Well, I have something. <laughs> We've got a friend. <laughs> we really worked for this one. Oh, man. We definitely searched all of our options, and if I wanted anything recent, this was it. But I'm excited. We're going to go pick up dinner because I'm starving. I'm going to be hungry because all we've been doing is shopping. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to go eat, and then we're going to clean up the furniture and put this out, and I'm so, so excited. <laughs> She's everything I'm dreaming of.
Okay, this is how the living room's looking so far. <laughs> half the sectional's over there, the other half is over here, and it wasn't too bad underneath here. I have no idea what that yellow piece is. It's like to a checkers game. Oh, that connect four? We have that? tons of rubber bands from Savannah doing her dog hair, hair, doll's hair, not dog hair. Dust, rubber bands, snowball, clips, beads so i'm gonna hey tiger he can see the vacuum chase has it out that's Thank why he's you guys for sponsoring this segment of the video ha, ha, ha. just, just kidding. kidding this is not a sponsored video and nope. dyson did not sponsor us nope. but welcome it should have <laughs> okay so we're gonna work on getting this clean So the boys love it, but if that big one gets sick on it, he's in trouble. Doug, I'm talking about you. <laughs> Got him to look sad. He didn't mean to. Okay, here's what it looks like so far. Now it's too far to the right. So we're gonna have to take this all back apart and shift the rug down to the left. But I like it. I switched out the pillows. So basically this starts a whole thing because I had to move pillows for my guest bedroom in here and my master bedroom in here. So now it becomes this pillow fight of what pillows go where. But when your house is all the same color, I just get to rearrange them. But I loved these big ones in our guest bedroom because we don't have a headboard. But they look better in here because <laughs> of the rug. <laughs> so this is what we're sticking with. I am gonna slide this down some. But let me know what you guys think in the comments if you like it. If you have nothing nice to say, then just don't say it. <laughs> it's 
been a long day. I've had some not nice comments. So keep it nice. Unless you can say it nicely, but yeah. That's what we're working with. Okay, I wanted to walk around and kind of show you guys what I decided to do. So these were the pillows on my sectional and I moved them in here now. I think they look good. And then this is how the living room turned out. So these like zebra striped ones were the ones that were on my master bed. And these big fluffy ones were on my guest bedroom bed and all these pillows are from Ross just so you know even the ones in my bedroom I buy all my pillows from there so it brought in this like much lighter softer gray so that's why I added these pillows and that blanket which then made my dark curtains over here not work so these are the curtains from my beauty room but I'm really liking let me stand back here so you can kind of get the full idea. So those are much lighter back there. Plus they're like, um, like darkening curtains. They're just like Savannah's that I put in her room. They're the same brand. I just have them in all different colors. I'll link them down below if you guys are looking for like darkening curtains and they keep the heat out. Um, but they have great colors and they're pretty on both sides. So that's what I like about them. Sometimes when you get like darkening curtains, they have a black on like the outside so you see them, but it's just the same color, but they do keep a lot of light out. So I've got that. So then the rooms on this side are what I'm gonna have to work on. So here's my beauty room. I do have just, these were already up and then I had the gray on the sides. But they don't close all the way. I gotta sand and paint that. That's from when we raised that bar. Um, I may just keep them white. It looks nice and airy. I just don't know how hot it will get in there if I have nothing just like keeping the sun out. And then this room is the room I'm gonna have to work with because there's too many shades of gray. I need to get a new blanket here. I'm gonna have to get another set of two big pillows here that I took off because I'm using them in the living room but I liked the height since we don't have a headboard back there these are the same curtains as Savannah and my dining room these really block out to the light because they're darker I've thought about moving those into this room but Chase thinks they'll be too dark how many shades of gray do you think are in there 49 <laughs> 50. Who knew there were so many? So yeah, and you can really see it on camera. Look at that. So I'm going to have to mess with all the pillows there, the blanket. I'll probably keep these. So I'll try to get things that go with this more. But look at that. Look at all those different shades. Chase has been in her plane. I ran him out. He heard me coming. Okay, I really hope you guys enjoyed this day in the life. It was a little crazy. Everything worked out though. We have the rug and I love the way everything turned out in there. If you're not following me on Instagram, I would really love for you guys to go over there and check it out. Um, always check my Amazon store when I find things. I link it in there so that you guys can buy them if you want to. I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.